A recent development in Google Sheets is a way that makes it even easier to create bar charts. Now, in another video, I showed you how to create bar charts using a table where you summarize the number of cases you have in each category. But Google Sheets is also able to do this with raw data. So here I just have a list of a whole bunch of followers. We have Pinterest, Facebook, Facebook, so on and so forth. We can scroll down. You can see they're all kind of jumbled in there. But we don't even have to count them. All I need to do is come over to this, insert chart, click on that and it creates a bar chart. It counts it all by itself. Now I'm going to still do a couple of things here to clean this one up. I'm going to change the title here so that it says social media followers by platform. I'm going to get rid of this legend because it's not helpful and takes up a lot of space. I'm going to change this over here to say just say followers on the vertical axis. And on the horizontal axis, I don't need that title at all. So I'm going to just delete that. And there you have it. You got a bar chart, quick and easy. Now, the only major qualification on this one is that you see the bars are out of order. What, what they are is they're in the order that each category first appears in the data. So you can see the very first one is Pinterest, the second one is Facebook, then we scroll down a little bit, we get Twitter. And you can't modify that. And so that's one small problem, but it still makes it really easy to see that most of the followers are from Facebook, the least are from Medium, and it lets you start getting insights in your data without even having to do the data prep of putting it in the table first.